Ladies and gentlemen, here and today we on the set. Good. Let's get into it. Hey guys, Lyrics from Sai here and today we're on the set of the Trini Drum Corner. This is a show produced by Birch Boss over on Birch Boss channel, link in the description, check it out for sure, for sure. Alright, should I leave it as a mystery? Should, and uh, the, the, the thumbnail is out. So, we kind of doing a behind the scenes, I'm going to give all that technical breakdown. Kind of, not too detailed, eh, but what we running. So, it's basically a drum cover. Um, with way too many drums, honestly. We don't need all of these drums, but that's how drummers just do their things. So they say, so put the drum right behind it. Right, so we're running three cameras as well as the one you're looking at right now. So over here we have, uh, hmm, what angle we call it this boy? Kind of focusing on the drummer, so when he's sitting and he's playing, we'll see him, as well as, you know, the cymbals and all that situations right there. And then we have a similar shot um, in the center here. However, it's a different angle looking up. This is a little more creative. Um, yeah, you probably couldn't see this in a YouTube tutorial on how to shoot a drum cover. But that's something you learn when you're actually out in the field, you know? You learn to maneuver and do things that people ain't showing you out there. Be creative. However, my favorite shot, that bad boy up there, which we kind of have up and running, but not quite. So, this is our overhead cam. <laughs> Basically, what I'm gonna do is set it, pull it up, right, really high, and then tilt it so it's actually over all the drums. So we get a nice overhead angle of him hitting everything. You understand? That's gonna be one of the better shots, at least to me, speaking from my own preference. We also have two GoPros, we have one on the and one in the corner from the cut to shot, shot, bam, bam, you see that? And that's basically the camera setup. Audio-wise, all the drums are mic'd up, running through the and going into the song room where it's multi-track. I don't to do with that. I just talking about this video. Now, if you actually want to see how all of this came together and how it looks, be sure to head on over to Birch Boss's channel and check out this episode of the Trinity Drum Corner. But it's a nice little slip method. I have nothing to do with audio. Let me talk to the person who does. Let's go and talk to Damar Bonner. He's running all the audio today, and we found exactly what's going on. So this is where the magic happens. And this is the magician himself, the man. Box Malo selector, boom. So, we say that everything multi track, right? Yeah. What that mean? A simple, simple term multi track is basically you try to capture individual channels. Mm -hmm. Right? So, you have a snare separate, boom. Your hi hat separate, boom. Thumbs separate, boom. Over it separate, boom. And you have the tracks. Right, right, right. So basically it's like at least mostly every single drum running on a different line coming yeah. into the mixer and he could control if they're too loud, if they're too soft. And then in post, whoever mixing it, you mixing it? Yeah, I'll Boom. Mix it. Big up you. So when he mixing it, <laughs> he could if the snare is too soft, he could bring it up. If the tom's too loud, he could bring that down. And if Mighty do crap, he could add another extra something just to kind of fix it. Okay, no, Mighty, I'm still teaching him, he didn't learn everything yet, so. Yeah, you can fix it up nice now, it can sound good. If that's a strange look, I don't know what that is. I want to hear a camera. Oh, it's... Okay, 
Yeah. Cause I know you have the truck out there. Yeah, so the truck. Basically, you know everything you need to know about mixing. You can go out there and mix anything because the margins give you the full rundown. Thanks for that free, you didn't have to pay. However, feel free. You have a Instagram, and you think people can check you out? What's this on there? Normal um, Instagram is Demarbana. Boom. Demar Facebook, Facebook, same thing, same Demarbana. Thing. Boom. Yeah. Making it easy for you to find them, and all those things will be in the description. You have no excuse. Go over by Demar and tell them, thank you so much for teaching me how to be a professional audio mixer. All the drumming done. Basically, what they're doing now is they having an interview. That's why I'm talking so quiet, so I don't disturb the interview. Um, I suppose we monitor the cameras and the audio, but I'm gonna run back to that. Um, so the interview said that we're using three cameras: um, a wide, and then a tight on the guest, and a tight on the interviewer. And then for the audio, we're running two lavalier mics into a Zoom H6. So I'll show you that setup now. But simple setup. You see the lights. We have a big key light. Um, and then we're just using the lights that we used to light up the drum. Um, we're just using it as like, you know, decorative lights. So let me show you that. So, all the glamour stuff done now. You cover everything. So, yeah, and we had to pack up everything the same way. Even though we're tired. Cause can't leave the equipment out there, you know? But it was fun. It was exhausting, but. Like that. I don't know. I know that. 